here. Today we have the 2S1 self lapelled howitzer. I will not attempt to pronounce the name. Here we have the business end of the 122 millimeter. Bow pane with the fording kit, which would come up to give extra clearance. Up front here will be the transmission with the engine compartment in the back. A lot of empty space inside here to allow these guys to be extra buoyant. Driver's hatch with the protective armor plate rusted in place. Driver's cupola. Interior. Manual transmission. With someone that has hand drawn the uh, gear shift ratio there. Twin uh, tiller braking system bottom we have the clutch on the left, brake in the center, and of course the steering tillers will work brakes as well. Gunner sight, we're a little windshield wiper. Commander's TC cupola with IR uh, night vision spotlight, it currently has the protective cover over it. Stowage, rear fuel tank, safe cable, rear hatch. There is unfortunately a diesel fuel leak inside here. I did not bring a flashlight and I am not going to be staying in here very long. Have more inside shots once I have a flashlight and this thing's aired out a lot more. Blackout marker lights. Auxiliary fuel tank there. Running gear. Very straightforward. Of course, the exhaust for the cover plate. It's very advanced for its time. The 2S1 ha features an auto loader very similar to the T72, um, only instead of actually fully automatic, the way the T72 has a carousel, uh, this the loader on the far side up there, and this system has been removed, but loader would uh, place an artillery on the tray, push the tray forward, and it would be auto rammed. Tray would be returned, he'd then place a powder charge inside a cylindrical case, and then that would be auto rammed. And then uh, the gunner there on the far end could fire it with the commander seat right there. Again, we'll fill more inside later. It is not pleasant to be inside right now as the stench of diesel is everywhere. And a rear firing port for your AK-47 or AK-74. Russians are big on those. Let's see the BMP th series. All right, that's all for today. Thank you for watching.